Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls 2, here's to reload the the mad. Now, we've got this new blocky set of armor and stuff and such. And we're now recording at 60 frames per second because an update apparently fixed the shit about that shit. So we might be able to do that fine, like without double degrading of item damage or item health. Durability. That's the one. Can I get to this guy? Nope. I haven't played in a while, I'll be honest with you. Like the last episodes up to this one have been recorded in the same session a while back. So there is that to consider if I appear a bit rusty at times. Which very well, very well might be the case. Not very well. I don't think this is the first time I've gone with very well. Well, I'll put this down just in case. Though I think I will cut down out the fight if I do get that fight again. Simply because you've seen that already. It's just for the benefit of quickly healing. To be fair. Okay, got my retrieval. And I got two opponents to fight, so that is not ideal. Especially since I can't actually remember how to play this game. That is not how we play the game. Alright, ah. I'm just gonna take a little run back. Have a quick look at the Lester's flask. And get summoned away for a bit. And that should actually help with the strategical situation. Also, that was apparently not for the Dragon Rider, that was for the old Dragon Slayer. That was actually where we were supposed to go be going now anyway. Okay, bounce back. Of course, taking on a boss kinda reminded me how to play the game, I think. Maybe. We'll see how it goes. Might be the case. Might not. We can summon this guy though. Which is gonna help. Come on, Master Sklankor. Uh, this is not your usual ride, but you're coming with us. Because we do want to slay the old Dragon Slayer. Though some would have thought that I would have slayed him already. In the past, in the previous series. I guess this must be a very, very authentic look-alike. Oh, it's just that guy. Okay, let's try to get this guy first. Like this. Ah, goddammit. For whatever reason... This guy was actually immune to damage for a second. Okay, now... There we go. Sorry, Clankor, about your health, but it happens. Another Hiding Knight sword. As I previously mentioned, this is the sort of sword I want on my other character. And I didn't get a single one of these on him. Alright, I... Huh. Clankor is keeping their attention. Gives me the opportunity to do absolutely nothing. Fuse. Well, actually, no. I did help. I helped, honest. For a moment there, I thought that Phantom was going to attack us. Remember how we were approaching this direction before? But then I completely forgot about it. Yeah, that happened. Now, for some reason, we don't have a single player to summon here. Which is sad. Very, very sad. Okay, Clankor, can you keep his attention and or kill him? Okay, he got his attention, that works. That worked very well. Okay, the dragon is still asleep, so... I think we might be able to just do this. Nope, nope, that did work. 
that was indeed my death. Now the more important question is, do I have a bow? I do in fact possess a bow. Do I have any arrows? Not nearly enough arrows to accomplish anything of importance. Well, we need to go somewhere where we can quickly get a couple of souls so we can quickly move on. I think there is something I can kill here. Let's do that. Yeah. I'll just go and get some arrows and that'll be right back. Alright then, we have more arrows and once again I will probably have to place a summon sign just in case I can human up freely. Because, you know, that's useful. Being human helps. Because not being human reduces my maximum health. Where's the Hydra Knight? Oh, over there. In that case, let's just touch back. We get an item from there. Did you hear that Hydra Knight? Hey there, hi there, whichever you are. The important thing is we get an item from there. Pardon sir, I did not intend to have you hit me. In case that happens to the best of us. A pale stone and a quick white summon sign. I'm going to hope of course again that it will be... That I get, get, get summoned for the quick boss fight. Instead of the whole long mess. But we'll see how it goes. Okay, that helped. So now we just need to kill that guy as well. Again. But you know, that's how it goes. Dying. Not a good part of the plan. In fact, I believe it's not a part of a good plan. Alright, be because that guy is leaving, then we just take on the Heidi Knight. Hey there, hi there, whichever. Might even be hate. Sir, that was most rude. Most rude. Not at all appreciated behavior. Alright, what about you? You wanna fight? That looks like he wants to fight. Just give him a two-handed sweep for now. I'm not even sure what I would want to use double weapons for. Something where I really cannot do anything to block. Guess that will... That would be the only really real reason to use that. Instead of what we're currently doing. Which looks to be retreating actually. Alright, let the Heidi Knight first, sir. Thank you. Now I can focus on you, sir. I want to get behind you, thank you. And there we go. Once again, this path is clear. And as we all saw, I got myself a bow and arrow. As you can guess, the reasons for that are pretty clear. It's a matter of really shitty tactics. Easy to survivable tactics, but really shitty ones. Pardon sir, I need to be of help to someone else. This is going to be inconvenient. Oop! Hello! Yeah, as I said, inconvenient. Here's my shield. Okay, this guy... Does it really do stuns as well as the other guys do, I guess? At least it doesn't tolerate them quite as well. Oh. Come on. I need to stun you, sir. Thank you. This was way too much trouble. Ah. Alright. Looks like we need to heal again. Huh. Uh, we are at full health again though, because we got summoned, which is always a pleasure. Now, 
I think this is the safe place where nothing can harm me. But I'm not sure I have enough arrows. This will take forever. Assuming I even have enough arrows. Come on. Stummy is also concerned, apparently. Well, I'll get back to you once we have something of relevance to report. But on the bright side, this took less time than getting the Drake sword. Because that took forever. Sheesh. Okay, we got our souls back. We got the petrified dragon bone and an item of some sort. Alright, I want to get Master Las, uh, where whatever his name was, with us as well. So, I'm gonna go and get him. Be right back. And there he is. So, we can now carry on. Lots of cuts this episode. Summonings, couple farmings here and there. Lots of cuts. Lots of cuts. Yeah. The old Radiant Knife Gem. There's a summon sign there. There's a summon sign, so that increases our odds of survival even further. The clan core will be a, a massive help as well. Okay, let's summon a bright demon. That should also help a lot. Those guys are really quite a hassle in... Which one was it? I know they were useful, like, actually difficult opponents in one of the Dragon Age games. Okay, yeah, let's do a high thing, like... A bow. And then let's rush in. Everyone pretend you know what you're doing, because I don't. Hello, Dark Pikachu! He looks a lot like Pikachu, doesn't he? But he's, like, darker in color. Whoop. Yeah, there he goes. And he has those dark attacks. Which are really, really mean. Not entirely a fan of those. Okay, we need to get out of there here. At least I did. Okay. This should help us help the battle. Whoop. This doesn't. Drink up. Okay, and once it's full health, we can actually go back in there. Oh, wait. I was using the wrong key. That's why it was dealing sort of damage. Alright. Take the opening. Okay, I will. Very well done. Very well done, indeed. Thank you, Bright. And thank you, AI. Yeah, see you around, Pride. Dual wielding axes is quite useful at times. Quite indeed. And now our world is freed of what appeared to be a resurrected Pikachu. That's my only explanation. A resurrected Pikachu. Okay, what's in the chests? Cracked blue eye orbs, of course. And this is the cathedral of the blue, which is why it was an of course thing. A cleric palma and a tower shield. There's options for new shields. Which one is cleric palma? That? Huh. Well, it has some defenses. As does this, but this is the allow us to parry. Which, to be fair, I never do anyway. Hello. Hello. Transient being. You have obtained proof you are worthy of joining our order. You may call yourself one of us and are free to plant your roots in this garden of the gods. Be proud. I, Targre, do proclaim from this day you are a knight of the blue. Rejoice. And bask in your new honor. Okay, yeah, sure. Though we didn't actually get to see someone a single blue knight. You, know. you are no longer a mere vagabond. You are now a guardian, a knight of the blue. Proud knight, take this. Thank you. Wear this ring and shine light upon stone. 
Then you will hear the voices of the Blue Apostles. Listen for their cries of help and repel the malicious invaders. This is the proud work of the Knights of the Blue. The way they elevate themselves to a higher plane. I'll provide what you need. You may visit me at any time. The issue with this whole thing is... Knight, you may come to me, Targre, for help. In the past, I didn't actually get summoned once. Alright. We Knights of the Blue must rely upon one another to achieve our greater goal. Present your token of fidelity to test your strength against other knights. We could try that, but I'm not sure I will do any better than I usually do. Ooh, a mid force, heavenly thunder, monastery charms, holy water urn, and imbues equipment with lightning. Oh, that's a pole stone. Huh. Do your work, and I will lend you strength. My other character has a ball stone hammer. It's a blacksmith's hammer, sure, but it's ball stone, and it's it's my little Mjolnir. My little Mjolnir, my little Mjolnir. Yes, exactly. All right, and uh, now we can travel back to Machula because we don't really have business here, and we're carrying forty-four thousand souls, which is something we should take care of. I can replace the blue seal with the guardian seal. Thank you very much. Hello. Let's level up. Uh, we want... We want stats. Yeah. Um, wait. Why is Vitality so much ahead of everything else? Let's just bring the others up to snuff as well. And then proceed on from over there. I want everything to at least 20, I think. We'll go Endurance first, because Stamina. Stamina is so good. This basically means uh, that we can... We have a little bit more survivability than before. And we could probably wear a helmet now, maybe. Actually, I'm not sure about that part. We could wear this hat. But I think there's some shading problems there, so let's not. Okay, okay. In that case, we should decide on our next destination. We have a variety of options, actually. Like the person we earlier s we saved earlier. Actually wants us to pay her uh, 2,000 souls, so we can't go that way. Never mind. Rested bonfire travel to no man's wharf. Or however that is pronounced. The important thing is we get over here. We could summon people. Uh, I let myself summoned, be summoned a thousand times here on my other character. Just so I could more easily learn the layout of the area. Which reminds me, I kind of want to light everything on fire. So, light torch. My desire to light everything on fire is... ...of absolutely no ill will to anyone... ...but server. It's just a matter of lighting these. Yeah, I know you wanna fight. Oh, you wanna fight as well, right? Well, that's one dead. That's too dead. Let me temporarily immune to all damage. And... Whoop. I think we'll go for this house first, because there's more people here. For us to take care of. Uh, for example, one of the archers. I don't want to have archers. You know. Just waiting to kill me. Well, the archer went downstairs. Oh well. In that case... I don't want to go downstairs, because there's an archer there, just waiting to kill me. Let's open this chest and see what's inside. 
The Titanite Shard of Amazing Welcome Site. Now oh, there's the archer. Alright, oh, these are actually. This sort of guys. I don't know if they're actually any stronger than uh, otherwise, but you know. They have intimidating horns on their helmets. I was hoping to use that helmet on my ordinary carrying character, but that didn't really work out. Ha! You tried to shoot me, but you know very well that my immunity is derived from attacking someone in the back. Yes. Alright, you dude. Get up. You don't, haven't got all day, you know. Goodbye. That was wondrously effective. I loved it. Alright, I'm gonna light a few fires and... Then we will proceed to the heart of the city. It's not a real city now, is it? No, it's like a small little part of a town. Yeah. Not a real city. It might be a port town. A smuggler port town of some sort, indeed. Probably for these fair folks who are trying to kill me. I do believe that they may be quite accustomed to smuggling goods. Come on, set the tight. I didn't come here to just to chat and walk. I came here to night nights. We can't just dark lights or something, you know? Yeah. Yeah. See? Alright then, uh, I'll call it there for now. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Oh, there he is. Must have done the full circle himself as well. Die. Die. Ah, diplomacy. Love it.